case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In a 1970 United States District Court case in Pennsylvania, Frankel v. United States, both drivers involved in a car accident were found responsible for the crash. The case centered on determining compensation based on the severity of the victim's injuries and the impact on their life. The accident occurred when Ronald Glasser, a Department of the Army employee, crashed his government vehicle into Mary Hames' car, with her daughter Marilyn as a passenger. The collision resulted in significant damage to both vehicles and severe injuries to Haim and her daughter. Two separate lawsuits were filed to recover damages for their injuries. After a trial, the court found Glasser and Haim equally at fault for the accident and awarded damages to the plaintiff for medical expenses, pain and suffering, and other related costs. The court determined that Glasser was negligent for assuming Haim was going to make a left turn without decelerating his vehicle. The court held both parties negligent and awarded damages to the plaintiff, taking into account Maryland's 30-year life expectancy and inflation. The court rejected a proposed trust fund and instead found institutionalization at $10-day necessary for Maryland's emotional issues. The government's counterclaim against Mary Haim was deemed invalid. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.